because it's a little bit unusual, I wanted to just do a quick demonstration here of how to add the plat map and do the annotation. So we're in total 2011 on the main form and down here the jump to forms you can see we added the plat map and so I'll click that. That'll put us here and we can right click to load a photo from file and then I've got my example one here so I'll go ahead and click that and open. Uh, the image optimizer will let it run and then as I said we can just use this example plat map here and uh, use parcel one as the one that we'll identify as our subject. So over here it pops up this map tools optimize and annotate. I'll click on that and it'll bring a new window here which I'll maximize and what I'll do is down here at the bottom are the tools. We can add a balloon, we can write on it, we can highlight, add some icons. So I'll click the balloon and then the plus sign. This is the unusual part to say, okay, I want to add a balloon. And so now you can see my cursor turns into little crosshairs and I'll click on the one and it'll give me an option if I've got some other properties in there. I can choose the one or I can create a custom balloon and say, okay, that's my subject. Now I can manipulate this. If I hover over it, I can pull the balloon here and point to it. So that's all we need to do here and then we'll save image. What I'll typically do on mine is also highlight the individual parcel and so I can do that here and we'll see we can change the line after we're done. I'm left clicking now I'll right click. Okay so that's done. Uh, and then the line, oops, I'll make the line thinner. I like the yellow all right so there's my parcel highlighted a uh, little bit off but for the reader of the report they can see where it's at and follow it on the plat map here. So then I'll do the uh, apply and save image and then I think we're good here. Let's go back. There's the first the order form, the URAR and now the plat map that's annotated and then I can come up here and save. So hopefully that will help you uh, if you're working with this tool.